Hello, everybody. And uh, this is Justin Pontarelli. And I'm going to be doing a small amount of Interstellar Pilot right now. I'm going to be answering a, a quick question um, about how um, Magnus EQs work. And guys, if I seem a little uh, slow and or out of it, and or if I lose my train of thought, it's it's because I'm actually having some pre-seizure symptoms right now. But um, my brain is mostly still working, and I uh, I can probably answer the question. But I'm gonna try to speed this up because I I can't take too long. Because the longer I work at this, the uh, worse my brain's gonna get. But I wanted to answer this question before I forget, and if I wait around until my uh, brain actually recovers, then I'll, I might forget about this question altogether. So let's get to it. I need a file, first of all, with lots of credits. Uh, that'll, that'll be fine. Right there, I think. Let's load that one. Okay. First of all, I'm gonna sit up and take a drink of water, guys, so bear with me. Part of my uh, pre-seizure trigger is probably dehydration. So here we are at one of my bases, I think. Yeah, I believe this is my Merc for Hire uh, file. Instead of trying to see if I have a, um, a Magnus EQ, I'll just... I'll go buy one. Guys, it's been a while since I've played this game, and my pre... Seizure, seizure symptoms make it very hard for me to string thoughts together, so I'll be very confused while doing this. This might take me a little while to figure out. Um, I think we want to go to um, menu. No, no we don't. Like I said, guys, my Mental facilities are not all there right now because of my condition. Oh yeah, property. There, that's the one. Okay. So go to property first. Or if you have a Magnus, just go straight to the Magnus. I remember this, this part mostly. Okay, enter. I'm going to click on my shipyard, enter my shipyard. Let's just go up and buy a Magnus EQ. Um, lots of credits here, so I don't really care too much. <laughs> that's, that's fine. Buy and enter. Um, let's just undock. I want to see if there's a, uh, military base. That is a military base, so... That's one of mine right there. Um, okay, I remember most of how to do this. Guys, my brain is mostly working for anyone who's interested about that. Okay, um, where's that station? Oh, there it is. It's not too far away. It's right there. Um, what I want to do first is try to equip this thing in case um, I get attacked while, while I'm inside of this thing. I want this thing to be as nasty as I can make it, and by nasty I mean, um, vicious. Let's just get rid of this, this stupid stuff here. We'll get rid of those two for now. Um... So this part has nothing to do with how you would um, answer the question, which, oh yeah, the question was basically, in case I didn't mention it already, I don't know if I did. Part of my condition is I have, like, little to no short-term memory at the moment. Um, how does a Magnus EQ work? 
in terms of its equipping abilities or equipping other vessels, I guess. Maybe selling its cargo. My first thought is that it's similar to a military base. Okay. Let's make front lefts. Um, actually, yeah, let's just do these. I don't think I want to make the whole thing the Laser 5s because that's kind of silly. Yeah, the top turret can be the military launcher. That's fine. The rear, right, and left. Actually, the rear turret can be a, uh, a 5. Rear, left, and right can be as they are, and uh, that'll be fine. Let's upgrade the shields and everything else to max. Okay. Don't worry, uh, whoever answered or asked this question, this is... This is not an inconvenience. I was just in bed, and I can't sleep anyway, and that would be... What I want to do in this case with my condition, I'll be okay for a little, for a few minutes doing this. Okay. Um. How how do I do this? Oh yeah, I know what to do. Okay. Okay. I'll just fly out somewhere randomly. So. Guys, this you can dock with these things. But at this point, you probably already know that. If you see my see my other videos, I actually do demonstrate how to dock with the Magnus. And I want to say right now that computer vessels can probably do the same exact thing. Um, but as far as buying a Magnus for the sake of using it so that uh, other computer vessels can dock with it, so you can make money. I would say that's probably not worth not worth it. If you want to just try to make money selling military equipment, just get a military base. But if your idea is to use this as a mobile base to re-equip fleets, then that's probably your best best use of this equipment. So let's try to get a simple, um, let's try to pop into a simple fighter ship. Okay. Oh, I'm trying to remember where we are here. Okay. We'll just call this the, the AP sector. We're in the AP sector. I don't even know if I have a, uh, why do I have those things? I think the Orions are the smallest ships I have. Yeah, they are. Okay. Okay. Let's... You know what? I think the Avenger is the one I want, would like to use, probably. Let's pop into the Avenger. Enter. Okay. Undock. Well, just in, care, just in case we're... Yeah, we're fine. Undock. Okay. Now, let's assume, for example, that the goal was to um, re-equip, re right? Actually, let's not do that quite yet. That'd be silly. I'm just going to dump all the cargo. Where are we? Oh, very close by. Excellent. Okay. Oh, that's the uh, wormhole there. Okay. Because I'm sorry if I sound so drained, it's because I am. Um, I'm kind of afraid that it could be the dreaded, um, you know, what virus. I'm not even sure if I am allowed to say that on YouTube at the moment. <laughs> um, but, but it's a possibility. Some of the symptoms include um, tiredness, which I've had for so many days now. Fever, which I, I feel a little feverish. Um, 
but maybe it's just nothing, I don't know. I also kind of feel really lousy in general when, um, when I'm having pre-seizure symptoms. I've taken my meds a couple hours ago, so I should be okay. Where's that ship? Oh, whatever, it's gone now. So, okay. So we're getting close to our target. Um, yeah, my brain's working well enough. That means I'm not gonna have a seizure while I'm doing this video, thankfully. But things are coming, coming to me. They're just my thoughts are flowing very slowly, but quick enough that I can do the video for you guys. So again, if you're if you skipped ahead and you're trying to figure this out. Um, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to demonstrate how one would go about using this thing as a mobile base. So first of all, you could you could fly the thing to whatever area you'd like it to be in. Like let's assume you want to use this thing as a, as a forward, you know, command center near the site of a of a huge battle, as opposed to using. I don't know, like a military base surrounded by turrets, which, in my opinion, would be cheaper. Although, yes, you could simply use a Magnus EQ and arm it with some really nice armament, and it would it would be just as nice, probably, as any other thing you could use. Okay. Um, anyway... Whether or not I like the Magnus EQ is not part of the video, so anyway. So let's pretend I just got done with an attack run using this ship. Maybe I blow up a couple turrets, maybe I blow up um, a military base of the enemy. Oh no, oops. <laughs> oh, there you go. Yeah, that's, that's why we don't want to do the video while I'm not... All there. Cargo. Let's so dump the cargo. Eject it, eject it. Okay, it's fine. Okay. Alright guys, so now we're just gonna fly into the thing. If I can remember how to. Oh, that's that'll do it. I'll just do it the easy way. There we go. Then all you do is... I, I believe it's trade. Okay. So, um... Normally with this ship, I would buy 30 Interceptor Missiles and then max out on ECM. There you go. Take that and undock. And that's how you would use this thing. Uh, that's how you would use a Magnus EQ in that capacity to rearm your ships. Let me just quickly see if I can... The only problem, guys, with using the Magnus EQ as a forward command post um, in order to rearm your smaller attack craft or fighters is that you cannot use it as a repair uh, base. Notice the option for repair is grayed out. Okay. And also, its docking capacity is not the same, as as far as I know, as a... Um, or I could be wrong, maybe it's just the same. No, let me just take a look first. Target uh, scan. Hangar bay. Components. Uh, shoot. Um... Okay, we'll look into that later. Right, let's just fly over here. Okay, I think this is my mil regular military base. I'll go in here. Okay, yeah, see this? Even though this ship here has no damage on it, I have the option to repair my ship at the military base. So, it's not a matter of my ship being damaged or not. 
you simply cannot use the Magnus EQ in order to repair your vessels. Um, so let's see if I can figure out how to... how many docking ports I have. I think you want to go to... Uh, I'll just... Um, I'll exit ship. Ah, station info, bays, stats. Hangar bays on a military outpost is eight. You can see that at the bottom of this list where it says hangar bays. So it's eight hangar bays. So you can have an entire fleet in here at once. Let's pop back in this thing here. Now we'll undock. That thing's gonna get its but handed to it and it just did. That was fast. Okay, so let's simply go to a... I think I should be able to see it this way, but... You now let's go in here. Let me see if I can do it this way. I want to compare hangar bays. Exit ship. Oh, that did not work at all. Ship bays. Uh, enter. Um, station info? It's listed as a station. Okay, so in comparison, okay, it has... It has six hangar bays and no repair facilities. So though, although you could make the argument that for a one million credit plus investment, you're getting a mobile equipment base, that can defend itself and fly away if necessary. And just like any other station, it can be defended by other ships, I guess, you know. But um, a million a pop, <laughs> or really one million plus if you want to really upgrade it properly, I, I just don't see how this would be worth the investment, but that, again, is beyond the scope of this video. This video merely means to address the question of how do you use this, how do you use the Magnus EQ in terms of equipping your ships with it. So again, once again, let's let's review that, okay? Let's just do a quick review. So let's say my little fighter here needs cargo um, missiles. Let's say my my Orion is out of equipment. It's out of missiles and ECM. In order to in order to simulate that, we're going, going to eject all the equipment. Then get within a range of your Magnus. Enter it. Go to trade and simply get the stuff that you'd like. Okay. And I don't know if you lose any credits, but I can I can check. Let's go to log transactions. And yeah, it looks like you do have to spend a little bit of money. Okay, look right there. I did lose credits. I lost credits there too. So you do have to spend credits Okay, it's not like you just can automatically and freely buy weapons, just like on your military base. Then you undock, and here you go, guys. And that's how you would do it, okay? And since it does have six hangar bays, it does follow that you could send an entire fleet into this thing and have them all get re-equipped one at a time. So whether or not that you want to purchase a mobile equipment station where you cannot uh, repair yourselves or you cannot re repair your fleet, that's up to you. Um, and as far as um, other ships from other factions docking at your at your at your Magnus. They can do that, and they could certainly 
Um, they could certainly buy equipment from you, although just like the military bases, you, you don't make a lot of money that way, okay? In fact, I doubt if you would even ever make your money back that way. So Magnus EQ, um, anyway, that, but that's not the point of the video to argue about the, or to analyze whether or not an, a Magnus EQ is worth the money. Okay. If you've watched my videos, you know how I feel about a Magnus. Okay, so anyway. But there you go, guys. So dock with it. Um, dock with it, go to trade. And just like normal, just like if you were... Just like if you had your ship inside of a military base... Buy the stuff you need, and that's it. Then you leave the sh you leave the ship on dock, okay? Do that for all your vessels that you need to equip, and you're all set, okay? And that's that's that. That's the end of it, okay? Um, and since I've really gotta get back to rest, I've gotta lay down, guys, and try to rest. Um, the more I try to think, the the worse my condition gets. Got a headache and uh, a little confused. So I know my symptoms are getting bad. I gotta drink some water. Anyway, so this has this has been Justin Pontarelli of the Orion class Avenger from the Merc for Hire Faction. Signing off and saying, guys, until next time, thank you for the great question. I hope I have answered it. Uh, to your satisfaction. Hope this has been educational. Um, it's always nice to meet another fellow player. Leave any questions or constructive criticism down below. And um, that's it. Okay. Guess have a great day, okay? Thanks for watching. Bye bye.